Hi hey guys, welcome to my channel, Me Conspiracies. Hope you guys are doing good. So I got a little spooky vibe going on here because this reading, honestly, I'm a little nervous for and it's a little spooky. So um, just want to put out there, this is for entertainment purposes only. Um, we're just having fun. I'm just using my cards. That's it. I don't know any facts about this place. Just what I look up from Google. But today we're going to do a reading on the Bohemian Grove. So if you guys don't know what that is, it's pretty much um, in California. There's a camp where these super rich men go uh, once a year and nobody really knows what they do there. And there's a giant like owl statue and people like... Um, I got a list of who's been there. So Clint Eastwood, uh, Richard Nixon, Ronald Reagan, and we got Mark Twain. I saw that Kid Rock went there, but just like a lot of celebrities and presidents and like CEOs and stuff go there and camp. I believe it's for like a few days, once a year. And I heard that it costs like, $25,000 to join so it's like a very exclusive club and there's been just a lot of rumors about what goes on there um, some people say that there's like human sacrifices they sacrifice like kids let's see what's going on there allegedly entertainment purposes only so let's start off with tarot Okay, what, let me ask, what's the purpose of Bohemian Grove? And the hanged man heard to talk. Hearing specifically to talk so they can't listen. We got is this oh five of swords i'm hearing not wanting um outside influence outside input almost kind of getting like these people that go there already have like an idea of things that they want to do and they just go there to talk about it a little bit more and put it into action. It's like even if other people don't agree, like we're still going to do it anyways. We don't really care. Um, so I feel like that's the main like, purpose of this place is to pretty much talk. We got Ten of Wands. Okay, I also just heard... Okay, this reading, I feel like it's just gonna be effed up, so... Just... <laughs> take whatever... Um, you don't have to take anything I'm saying literally, but... Again, this is for entertainment purposes only. I heard, like, we go there to like cheat on our wives too. Um, we have like freedom to do whatever we want, say whatever we want, I'm hearing be whoever we want. So yeah, they must bring in maybe women. I'm seeing them doing like really weird stuff. Like, what is it called? Um, like, SCX that's, like, really crazy and wild and, like, I'm almost kind of getting, like, a little bit of a torturing vibe or, like, there's definitely, like, a kinky vibe to it. Got Ten of Swords in reverse. Let's pull some oracle cards. So what is the purpose of Bohemian Grove? We have growing 
I feel like they have talks. It's like we already already decided on something, but we're just going to meet here and make the final agreement or maybe they getting even like signed papers. I'm getting like we don't want any outside influence. We don't want any outside input. We all agree on the same thing, so it almost feels <laughs> this makes sense that they may have like started their own religion. Or like they all have the same views or something. There's a similarity between them all. You have in love in reverse. And allegedly I do feel like this is for this is a place for men that aren't either in a relationship or aren't in love with their partner. They kind of go here to like, just do whatever they want. Getting like, they sleep with multiple people. I'm hearing 10. So they may go there to sleep with like 10 different women. Um, yeah. I don't think I said this this in the beginning, but this place is for men only. <laughs> so I feel like there's drugs, alcohol there. We have coworker. I feel like sometimes there's people that aren't really on the same like level or like I don't know why I'm hearing this. We're meeting people that have the same effed up views. This is kind of giving me like bachelor, like we're kind of crazy. It's like a bachelor party. Like that's the vibe I'm getting. I can relax, I can get away. I can discuss some business, but I feel like that's not what they mainly want to do there. Mainly just want to do whatever they want. And we have make changes. Okay, so let's look into the conspiracy deck. What are they doing? Or what's the purpose of Bohemian Grove? We got first card. Accident. Okay. Got contracts. And if you guys don't know what this is, definitely look it up. <laughs> Yeah, I, like I said in the beginning, I do see him signing contracts, making agreements, and then I'm picking up, um, let's see, see them doing, like, rituals, it's rituals towards what Maybe that what they signed a contract for or what they want to put into motion. Like they're putting energy, doing some kind of ritual to make whatever they're wanting to manifest. They have drugs. Wouldn't be surprised if maybe some of the newer people that join, um, are like so heavy on alcohol or drugs that they don't really remember what happens at these places or like they'll see really messed up things. I also feel like they have to sign a contract saying that they won't talk about certain things because I do see them. Okay, let's see. What are they doing? Or what's the, pur what's the purpose of Bohemian Girl? 
We have Illuminati in reverse. We have Missing. Symbols in reverse. Murder in reverse. I'm gonna ask what the owl's for because this is certain to tell me a different story. So if it's Sam, what I think it's Sam, the other cards, or if I ask this question, it's gonna tell me. So let's see. Okay, what is the owl for? Getting something with eyes, like. It's the owl's always watching, keeping an eye out. Yeah, I'm seeing an owl at night. So I'm getting like nighttime is usually when they do some kind of ritual. They also do it at night so people can't see or the people that are there can't see like everything that's going on. What's the owl for? We have Ten of Cups. Nine or Eight of Wands reversed. What's the owl for? Queen of Swords reversed. Nine of Swords. I'm getting like it's I would say it's probably a god for them. I wouldn't say it's a god, I'd say it's um, is it like an entity or I'm hearing we give to it. So they give things to the owl. <laughs> Let me see what else, what is the owl for? Bohemian Grove. Repeat patterns. So, yeah, there's like rituals that they do. I feel like every year we have moving and trust to get things moving, to get luck on their side, I feel as well. Okay, allegedly, I'm picking up this is like a lot of men that just aren't happy in their marriage like if they're married they're not happy um very greedy i wouldn't be surprised if a lot of them have like big egos i just get that these men like find joy or happiness through like outside influences, so money, drugs, alcohol, SEX. And they come together and it's like all of these men have like same ideas and stuff. Okay, what is this owl for? I think they there's a specific ritual that they do every year and they've been doing for like a super long time like I don't know when this place opened up but it feels like someone started a ritual a long time ago and now they just do it every year. I'm also picking up like these men here. Not gonna lie, I feel like they're creepy. 
like this card too. Like some of them are probably that as well. Okay, again, like another kind of contract. Yep, doing ritual. Here's accident and the contract card again. What do they mean by accident? What is the accident? What's accident mean? If they're scared. What does the accident card mean? Because that you can make it a little confused. What does the accident card mean? Oh, okay. Since we got it with the contract card, it's saying like what you see here. Okay, I want to say what you see or hear at this place you do not repeat it and things that they do here aren't by accident like a lot of this stuff is pre-planned again they've been doing it for a really long time it's just some of these people that join are like newer We have staged. I think I heard that there was an actual stage there. But I guess the owl is kind of on a stage. Money is power. So this is even giving me like these rich guys are trying to manifest like more money. But I see them like actually giving something to the owl, so let's see what they're giving to the owl. What are these people giving to the owl? Queen of Pentacles reversed. Five of Pentacles reversed, Page of Wands reversed. What are they giving to the owl? Okay. Allegedly, I'm also picking up. We said, I said before, I was showing you guys the cards. Um, I see people drinking something, um, which I do feel like is blood. <laughs> uh, and this isn't giving me like animal blood. It, this is giving me more of like it's human. Um, I keep hearing like the blood of Christ, but it's like they're not saying that. They're probably saying something else but they're drinking something and they're drinking this blood you have record deal oops you know what this just reminded me of have you guys seen jennifer's body where in that movie they they sacrifice jennifer um so they can become the band can become like more famous like it's giving me that vibe What are they sacrificing to the owl? Satanic. And I really see them drinking something. I mean, I won't be surprised if it's 
child one These people are into some weird stuff. I'm also hearing friends with, uh, what's his name? Jeffrey Epstein. So you may see these people are friends with him too. Cause he does weird things. And if you guys haven't seen, I did, I did a video on him and I got that he was still alive allegedly. So, and there's, yeah, so that's what they're doing. They're doing this. We also have cult. Let me see if I can figure out what they're burning. Like in this picture, they're all standing around a fire. What are they burning? There's that contract card again. What are they burning? What do they burn? Government involvement. Illuminati. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I keep seeing a vision of like, allegedly a baby, but like when it's in like the womb and it's like, like curled up like that, like I'm seeing that. So like a newborn baby. I wouldn't say, well, maybe it's a, f yeah, I keep seeing a vision of like a small, if it's not a, no, I feel like it's, <laughs> I was gonna say, if it's not like a human, it's maybe an animal, but I'm getting like it's a human. Now we got ritual. So pretty much they go there, they have SCX, they do drugs, they drink alcohol, they do whatever they want because they're not happy in their relationships or they're just not happy in general. And then they go and do a ritual, a sacrifice. Um, to manifest more fame, power, whatever they want. Or if they go there, we have New World, world Order. Um, like this I'd say probably for the presidents I went there, it's like we already agreed we're gonna do something, we're just gonna meet up there, talk about it a little bit more, sign contracts, and then do the ritual, and then just let it manifest. Let it happen. I keep getting these cards. So these are weird people. I feel like if you see... I was gonna say, if you see like certain people going to this, or they keep going, like these people are weird. These people are creepy. I mean, honestly, it's disgusting what kind of ritual they're doing. So it's definitely, um, I don't know what you would call that, like satanic or dark magic. I keep getting this accident card. Let me see, what the heck does this accident card mean? We have money in reverse.
stolen. I, I think this is gonna open up a whole nother, a whole nother reading, but I'm getting like, some things that happen in these people's lives are not accidents. If there was like, let's say a miscarriage or someone got into an accident and they passed away, like some of that isn't actually an accident and then they use whoever that was for this ritual as well. Yeah, human trafficking. I don't know if I should say this or not, but you know, I'm just gonna say it because this is what I'm seeing. So I kept seeing my my third eye, Chrissy Teigen, and I was thinking, I kept seeing like her and her husband like doing something with, with a newborn baby. And then I was thinking, um, did she have a miscarriage? So I just Google it. Googled it and she did in 2020. I wouldn't be surprised. I don't know, did one of them or, well, obviously just he could go because it's just for males, but, or men. So did, did he go there? I don't know, this is getting a little, a little sketchy, but, like I said, this is for entertainment purposes only, and just having fun with my cards. Um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. <laughs> and hope you guys have a great day. Bye.